Hi friends, it's Moses here at the Driver Success Channel. So today I just want to talk about a subject that I have already talked about and that is um, how much truck drivers make. I have made a video where I said that instead of um, instead of asking how much truck drivers make the question, you should change around that question and come from a different angle altogether. Uh, you should first find out how much money you want to make and then ask yourself can i make this amount of money driving trucks and uh, and figure out what it takes to make that uh that kind of money uh, what kind of endorsement uh what um uh, what division of uh trucking uh, you should go into uh what company uh could uh, could you uh be a part of that will help you make that amount of money uh, what sacrifices are you willing to make uh, to make the kind of money you want to make? That is a better way of um, answering that question than just asking a general question of how much money can I make? Uh, how much money do truck drivers make? And today I want to share with you uh, three examples to show you the difference in how much money one can make in trucking. I did an interview with a gentleman. Um, his name is called uh, Terry Rushing. Uh, he's here on YouTube. I will put a link uh, to his channel in the description below. And he said, you know what? Just take a, a listen. Let me, let me play you the clip of, uh, of that interview so that you can hear for yourself. Terry, on average, how much do you think you made as a company driver for that 10 or so months you are driving? Uh, how much do you think you grossed as a company driver? Okay, uh, well, uh, I was with the company as a company driver for about nine months. In that time, my driver's pay, without the apprenticeship, was a little over $19,000 for nine months. So, mm -hmm. not, not too, not too, not too good. <laughs> Nin 19,000? 19, yeah, a little over 19,000 for nine months. Now, is that gross or is that take home? That was gross. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. Yeah. There you go. You had it. So in his first year, he made about $20,000, right? Now, that is one example. Another example is a gentleman here on YouTube. Uh, his name is Red Viking Trucker, right? Uh, he has a YouTube uh, channel and I like the videos he makes because uh, he answers a lot of questions. Uh, he tackles a lot of stuff. And uh, he made a video uh, where he talks about how much money he made in his first year and he made about I'm gonna put a link to to that video in the description below but he made about seventy thousand dollars in his first year so you can see the difference one made twenty thousand the other made seventy thousand but you will be able to hear from uh, Red Viking Tracker that um, he tells you about the sacrifices that he makes uh, other sacrifices that he made to make that kind of money. Now I will let you know I did not make seventy thousand in my first year, and I did not even make seventy thousand last year. But again, it's because uh, my priorities are a little bit different. As I said, um, these are two different drivers with uh, two different outcomes. Now I also made another interview with a driver who makes about one hundred thousand dollars a year. And this is a company driver. He is not an own operator. He is a company driver. And all he does is really um, something not that hard because what he does is uh, what you, you call line haul. Uh, uh, he drives from California, goes to Arizona, uh, takes his 10 hour break in a, in a hotel, and then uh, drives back to California, goes home. And then does, he does that the following day. He drives to Arizona, drop and hook, takes his 10 hour break in a motel, drives back, goes home. And at the end of the year, he's making about $100,000. And as I said, he is a company driver. So the opportunities are out there. It's all about looking for those opportunities and knowing the kind of sacrifices you are willing to make. Let me play you a clip of that driver here uh, so that you can hear what he said on the podcast if if you don't mind sharing roughly speaking how much uh does it pay a year 
Uh, I currently, um, because I'm I'm a California driver, which the 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 specialty with that is they pay us California drivers hourly, and so we get paid. I'm top end is thirty five dollars an hour, which uh, equivalents to a roughly a hundred grand a year. So there you have it. As I say, it's not the question should be how much do you want to make and then go out there and figure out are you able to make it? What are the sacrifices that you are willing to make? Uh, which company will give you the opportunity? Uh, what endorsements or what um, a section of tracking do you need to go to? And then I guarantee you if you can be able to figure that out, you'll be able to make the kind of money that you want to make. So I just wanted to share with you uh, that to help you understand that it, it depends on your work ethic, it depends on the company you work for, it depends on the endorsements, it depends on the sacrifices you want to make. So as you think of um, uh, making money in tracking, uh, you need to put all these things into consideration and then go out there and make the kind of money that you want to make. Until next time, it's Moses here saying stay blessed and stay safe.